What is going on YouTube? Welcome to the Living Free channel. My name is Tyler Freed and in this video I'm going to be talking about why trucking is so stressful, why it is so stressful, why it is so hard for the majority of people who get into this industry and I hope that by the end of this video if you are new to trucking and uh, or you're just struggling with being a truck driver I hope by the end of this video you will see that there is a way to really enjoy this career so if you're new thank you for clicking on the video make sure you stay tuned to the end so you can hear my entire point that I'm gonna be making and uh, that is why trucking is so six or so stressful for the majority okay and here's the statistic on new truck drivers getting into the industry and out of 100% of truck drivers, 90% of them that enter the trucking industry quit within the first year. The turnover rate is very high in the trucking industry. And I'm gonna explain why that is, and I'm gonna explain to you, somebody that is new to this industry, how to not want to give up and want to quit, and actually how to spot the opportunities that are in trucking. Now, first and foremost, I wanna let you know what you're looking at. Right now, I'm in the western part of Nevada, uh, just south of Reno, like right on the border of uh, California and Nevada. It's absolutely beautiful out here, and <laughs> I'm actually kind of being sarcastic with saying trucking is stressful. It is not stressful to me. To some people, it is. But if you come into this business, and those of you that do watch my channel, know where I'm gonna go with this. If you come into this business with a plan for your money, that is the biggest thing. I did read a statistic the other day. I don't know how true this is, but it, it, I, believe, I believe it is partly true, and that is that 70% of Americans do not believe they're gonna have enough money at retirement. And I actually think that's true. I, I really do believe that because most Americans do not prioritize saving. And it is so vital. I don't care whether you're a truck driver. I don't care whether you're anything. Whatever career you're in. But I'm talking about trucking because that's what I do. And that's who really watches my channel. Is people interesting in the, interested in the trucking industry. Understand, trucking's no different than anything. You can make six figures in trucking, you can go beyond six figures in trucking if you go the business route. If you take this career serious and you learn what you need to learn to become good at doing this job, good at doing this career, that's how you make a lot of money in trucking. It's no different than being a lawyer, doctor, yada, 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 okay? But beyond becoming really successful just in trucking, the important thing is to use that income you're making to set yourself up financially. You're not gonna enjoy any job at all if you do not set yourself up financially with whatever job you're doing. I don't care what it is. You can make a million dollars a year, but if you spend 1.1 million, meaning you're going into to debt, every single year deeper and deeper in debt because you have a very big luxurious lifestyle funded by debt you're broke you're broke i don't care how much money you make it's not about how much money you make necessarily it's more about what you keep and also what you keep and invest into assets something i talk about a lot on this channel and that is the core message of my channel the reason I was inspired to make videos on YouTube is because I didn't see any content about what to do with the money you make in trucking. I did see great content. There's a lot of great channels out there about how to start your own business in trucking, how to make a lot of money, right? But there is no content about how to manage that money once you get the money. That is what's important with anything that you do. I'm telling you, like I always say on my videos, if you can use trucking to get completely debt free, build up a six month emergency fund in cash, and then beyond that, start saving 40, 50, 60% of your income and putting that either into real estate, stocks, save up, become an owner operator, start a fleet, whatever, start investing your money, getting your money to make money for you. 
getting your money to work for you, not you working for money. See, when I go, when I'm driving this truck, I am trading time for money. But when I invest money into assets that pay me passive income and go up in value over time, they appreciate in value. When I do that, I'm trading money for time. When I invest, I'm creating time in the future, right? Because eventually, my portfolio is going to reach a point. Now, it's going to take time. It's going to take different time for different people because your savings rate may not be as high as mine or your savings rate may be higher than mine, right? Some people are only able to put away 25% of their income, 30%. I'm able to put away 50 to 60% of my income, but hey, if you're putting away 20, 25% of your income for a 20, 30 year trucking career, okay, making 80 to 110, 120,000 a year, that's just at your job. That's not including if you buy your own truck and make even more than that or build a fleet, yada, yada, yada. If you're investing a large percentage of your income living debt free, having that emergency fund in place, you're going to enjoy this job way more. I do not wake up, look at this. I get paid to look at this. It's amazing. It's absolutely gorgeous out here. Now, it's not always like this. Sometimes I gotta deal with the big mega cities and traffic and, you know, the BS that does come with the job. But, overall, I enjoy what I do. I enjoy it. I do have freedom, why? Because if this company doesn't work out, Creek Carrier, they're a great company, it is working out. But if it doesn't work out, I've got a six month emergency fund. I've got money in the stock market. I got multiple six figures invested in the stock market. Man, if I gotta change jobs, I can change jobs. Set yourself up and put yourself in a position where you have freedom to choose, freedom to move if you've got to move. I'm not tied down to any one company. I'm not. Why? Because I've set myself up financially. Now, if you're starting from nothing watching this video, that's totally fine. Just understand that that's what you need to start doing. And once you start digging yourself out of the hole you're in, majority of Americans are living paycheck to paycheck. They're deeply in debt. They don't have any savings. But if you can accomplish what I'm talking about, getting completely out of debt, your bills will be very low, and if you have that emergency fund, that's protecting you from going back into debt, and it's also protecting your assets that you start investing in, okay, because if you have that emergency and you have $20,000 in cash, no debt, you can cover just about any emergency with that amount of money, with six months worth of living expenses saved up in cash. Okay, and starting to invest beyond that, that's where you start building real wealth. But that's the point. The point of this video is to understand that in order to not be stressed out over the road, you have to be going somewhere. You have to be on the path to freedom. Legit, like financial freedom. That's how you do it. And it's not that hard to understand how to do it. It's hard to actually follow the steps and be disciplined and learn a few things that you need to know about investing and personal finance and things like that. But you don't have to know a whole lot. Personal finance, Dave Ramsey says it all the time, personal finance is 80% behavior. It's only 20% head knowledge. You don't have to know a whole lot, but you got to do what you know. You got to do what you know. You got to have that discipline. That's life, okay? So anyway, that is my message for the day. If you're stressed out and trucking right now, it's because you don't have a plan. It's because you're not setting yourself up financially. That's why. And once you get on the path of building wealth, creating financial freedom, financial peace, once you do that, you're gonna enjoy what you're doing way more because you're gonna wake up every day and you're not super stressed out. That's why I love trucking. That's why, I mean, I love it because I get to see what you're seeing now, but I love it because it's setting not only myself up for generations, but it's setting my son and my wife up. That's what it's doing. And so, anyway, that's my message for the day. I really appreciate each and every
and every one of you for watching. God bless and have a great weekend. And if you see this video after the weekend is over, anytime after that, God bless you. Thank you for watching and peace out.